might hear my 3D printers, but I'm gonna try and talk over it and maybe try to drown it out in editing. I can't tell you if it's gonna work or not. But anyways, so I'm in my RC room. And a lot of you know that I make these gooseneck trailers and I have been for like the last two or three years. But I wanted to upgrade that to a full other design that I did have in the works a while back. But it never got done because I was busy with work. So these are my super simple design trailers. Now they hold weight, they flex a little bit, but literally hold a lot of weight. So this is the new design. It uses Traxxas spindles from like a rustler. Part numbers are in the file I have on Colts. It's super cheap. You could build these trailers for under 25 bucks and all you really need is a drill and a 3D printer. It's not that bad. And a lot of people have 3D printers nowadays. So this is the bumper pole design. It's super easy to build. Now you get into a little more complicated. So I took this design from my gooseneck trailer design and extended the neck here another inch up. So that way you get the drop that you need to make it a low pro instead of having all that suspension. And this is the same spindles as the other trailer, nice and low. No movement, like once again, but, and printed fenders. Those are included in the file now as well, two, the two axle and the three axle trailer fenders. These are super scale looking. I'm super happy with the way they came out and I hope you guys enjoy them.